your three biggest funders, according to Open Secrets, I don't know if you want to dispute this, uh, is Travelers, Company, J.P. Morgan, and Blackstone Group. Um, wh why, why shouldn't regular people see things as, you know, you're sort of doing the bidding of the, of the big bank? Well, I, I haven't done that. The people of Alabama know that I do their bidding, and the American people that I know I stand up for them. Uh, what, uh, I don't represent uh, banks, I represent people. Some people uh, represent banks, but they're hired to do this. I'm hired by the people of Alabama. Um, you, this week saw a battle between the realtors and the banks, basically small businesses and the banks, and, and you decidedly came down uh, on, on the side of uh, the banks instead in terms of credit card and debit card. Fees. Well, there's a cost for any transaction and, uh, if, and for a convenience, and I believe that we should not let the government set the price of anything in the marketplace. That's what they would do. That should be set by private parties. Um, you know, in... When the, during the financial meltdown, uh, it was portrayed as an emergency, that we got to bail Wall Street out or uh, else it's cataclysmic. And now, not just from you, but from the, the you know, Obama is saying that uh, fixing uh, unemployment will take time. Uh, why is there urgency uh, when it comes to, oh my gosh, the banks are in trouble, but not urgency when it's, oh my God, middle, middle America. Well, if you go back to history, you'll recall that I was the one that opposed all the bank bailouts. All the car bailouts, the market should work. We should not throw taxpayers' money at that. We should, should let the market create jobs. We should uh, save people's money, and that's what I have always stood for. All right.